Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Elhamdülillah. Zalimun ve salatu ve selamun ala seyyidina ve mağlana Muhammedin ve alihi ve sahbihi ve zuvacihi ve zürriyeti ecmain. Allah'ım Rabbana arzuna al-Hakk'a hakka murduk ve tibah. Varina ba'at ve 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 ba'at. Allah'ım arzuna hakka hakka la şiha kama hiya. Allah'ım sarı uliyak fi masharik al-Hadi ve mağaribaha ve farijan ibadika fi masharik al-Hadi ve mağaribaha. Sallim ve sallim ala seyyidina Muhammedin ve alihi ve sahbihi ve zuvacihi ve zürriyeti ecmain. Okey. So the post um, Maoist uh, CCP um, has built an absolutist state, absolutist capitalist state. Table one, table one contrasts liberal and absolutist capitalist state. So, States can be capitalist state can be liberal. Slotus so Chinese China at the moment is can be categorized as uh, absolutist capitalist state. So we can contrast these two types of state according to their tasks, personal recruitment, resources. Modus vivendi, um, patterns of authority, output, and foreign policy, blah, 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 blah. Let's see. It's based on um, uh, okay, let's see. So this is uh, just a general contrast between structures absolutist capitalist state and liberal capitalist state. obviously this is an ideal type and heuristic uh, so the first is task so in, in a sense this is uh, interesting for its own sake as well this contrast so task is um, liberal state's task is to establish market dominance over society. Uh, liberal society, uh, a mature liberal society, the market society. Separation, separation of um, public and private sphere, spheres in society. So separation of public and private spheres of society. So private sphere is ruled through this uh, separation. So this separation is, a, is an essential element of liberal theory, but also it's a technology of government as well. Come back to that. So expansion of the public sphere. So rather than um, separation, you have expansion, but it's not clear. So public sphere does most things. Maintaining the balance between plan and private, private economy, market authority. The market is there, but it is married with planning. Private atomization. So people are uh, atomized. There's no private sphere in a sense. So there's individuality and then there's a public sphere. That seems uh, to be the case anyway. Um, might be, it might not entirely be correct, but we'll come back to that. Personal recruitment, what does that mean? Um, maybe it is personnel recru recruitment. So intellectual and personal qualities enabling effective representation leading to an observ 
a leading to an absorption absorption of the will of all into general will the general will is basically uh, rationality which is a capitalist rationality the individual will exist uh, you recruit people according to their intellectual and personal qualities and you have effective representation not just in parliament but all sectors of society and through education and political mobilization through law etc you convert uh, individual will into general will okay the footnote 28 says that the liberal capitalist state ensures that the majority of all the majority of the citizenry the will of all continues to endorse the general will which legitimizes capital accumulation as a socially supreme end in itself the general will is a rationality which so everyone is socialized into it and uh, the task of state is that most citizens keep supporting and endorsing this general will and inculcating it or personifying it in their private life technical uh, so technical and mobilization ability to ensure enhanced mass acceptance of the governing group's conception of the general will so the mobilization here is more so general will is conception of general will is so elite are the one who believe in the general will and they try to impose that general will or try citizen to accept that general will through technical means and through mobilization through education, through basically uh, providing them the fruit of uh, that mobilization, or fruit of uh, the implementation of general will. That's not entirely clear, but 29, let's see. Uh, number 29 is the longest footnote. Let's read that so that might make it a bit more clear. So, increasingly publicly sanctioned market transactions are presumed to define the general will. Okay. And not just the elite. The liberal capitalist state seeks to protect and promote through law and administration specific mar market conceptions of the general will. Okay, that's more clear. In absolutist capitalist states, the governing group, it's a governing group, that's the party and its functionaries and the state and its functionary define the general will. Okay, they tell us on the basis of prioritized group, usually nation or class. So conception of general will is uh, the defined through not the will of all but the will of a nation in the case of nation state and the will of class in the case of socialism and the will of party as well and if you have a mixed uh, nationalist uh, socialist uh, capitalist state like china then you have all three elements there so a notion of nation and class and the party defines what general will is what is this usually lead to greater or lesser increasing or decreasing subordination of market to plan and planning is done by these people who know what is the general will for a classic discussion of the relationship between the will of the whole to the will of general c russo for a justification of conserving For, for a justification of conserving the general will as the will to 
perpetually prioritize capital accumulation as the socially supreme and I'm sorry and all those people okay now resources in liberalism I mean in liberal state you have taxation the in absolute state you have public investment taxation and price setting either resources modus we went die how do you do that impersonal rule in application legalism is the main way through its governance administration impersonal so that's bureaucracy and legalism are the means through which uh, people are socialized into and the general will is impossible so governance is with the way administrative decree governing groups are uh, gaining infectionalization so within parties selective uh, subsidization and penalization patterns of authority uh, within liberal state you have separation of executive and legislative and judicial and judiciary and uh, apparatus and bureaucracy hierarchy so that's the uh, liberal state um, in Sluter state you have executive dominance ad hoc intervention initiatives of apex political authority party organization at mass level so party is important a leader is important uh, and three executive executive dominance and output domestic policy um, should we stop or let's see probably we can cover this table and we'll leave the rest of the discussion for the next time so output uh, domestic policy legal procedure unification development of the market I, a legal procedure unification mean throughout the nation i guess um administrative regulation also of market forces the market is regulated as well development of productive forces through investment in education and also equitable uh, investment in technology and production etc foreign policy international cooperation competition promotion of global market strength of national uh, nationally based capitals but they are internationalists they are international rules imposed by the leading state of the capital war unending to sustain come so war is a mechanism to sustain competitive advantages war is important imperialist expansion for preferential access to markets and resources uh promotion of interests of national capital through international bargaining that's absolute state formal separation of state officials and social organization S state society relationship that's in liberalism merger of public private bureaucracies private bureaucracies what are private bureaucracies state official penetration of mass organizations so um, public private distinction is blurred in here it's blurred here um, i mean blurred in a liberal state as well but through the technology of separation and education and all the technology is different and the actual formal separation is there uh, social spirit is discipline following rules self-discipline is the basis of all so education technical flexibility and mass mobilization that's the social spirit okay so let's stop here and we'll um, 
So the, obviously China does not, of course, neatly fit into absolutist capitalist state category, which is no more than a heuristic device. Nevertheless, China is significantly closer to the absolutist than the liberal capitalist strategy. China is no longer. So let's start from here next time. Subhanakallah wa bihamdika na shakullah ila illa anta rasakhir wa natawul wa sallam wa sallam ala Sayyidina Muhammad wa alihi wa sahabihi Azwaji wa zirizid min rahmatika ya rahman wa rahman